<laughs> Have you ever had this happen to you before? You get upset at a drive-thru. That's right. You wait for more than three minutes and you start getting upset because it's supposed to be fast food. Uh, you actually get upset because you want something quicker. You expect it now. And whether this has actually happened to you or not, I think we've all been frustrated at times by not getting what we want immediately. Because let's be honest, we live in a now society, instant gratification. We can go to our high speed internet and we can type in something in Google and find research immediately. Uh, credit card debt shows us that we just have no patience. Credit card shows us the debt is the national high because people are buying things when they actually don't have money. And so they're living in this sensation of, I want this now, even if I don't have it, the resources to get it. Can I just remind you in our society uh, that patience is a virtue? I know it doesn't seem like that because we want everything immediately and we get upset when that doesn't happen. But did you know that Galatians 2.22 says that patience is part of the fruit of the Spirit, walking with God. It's an attribute of God, that He is patient and gentle with us. That when we teach the Bible, 2 Timothy 4.2 says we're to preach the word with patience. Ephesians 4.2 says we're to have relationship with one another and love one another in patience. Paul, Colossians 1.11 actually prays for people like you and I, the church, to have, you guessed it, patience. Why patience is so important? Well, maturity takes time. We want to get things overnight, but God is really interested in our faith and maturing us and growing us. God wants us to be solid, to have a foundation that trusts Him and that actually embraces trials and testing with gratitude and joyfulness. So what does this mean for you and I? Well, it means as people, followers of Jesus, we're not going to get everything immediately. We're not going to mature overnight. You may not have all the answers and you don't need to be frustrated because you could trust God and you could understand that maturity takes patience and this is a part of God's plan. In Acts chapter 16, we see Paul doing some crazy things, still planting churches. He's still discipling guys like he picks up Timothy and Titus. He's just continually doing the work that God has called him to do. And this work didn't happen overnight. He had to have patience and he had to remain faithful. It says in verse 5, the churches were strengthened in faith and they increased in numbers. All because Paul was patient and continued to do the same things God called him to do. Can I just encourage you and remind you, maturity takes time. God has maybe called you to do great things, but it's going to require patience. So don't give up.